Don't forget to smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel. And remember guys, this is for adults. Guys, don't forget to check me out on Instagram, Pinterest, and especially over on ZachJackDan.com for all the photos you want of these videos. What's up, you guys? This is Zach Jack Dan with another Every Marvel Legends video. This is talking about Every Marvel Legends Ultron figure. So first time we saw Ultron was in the Toy Biz Legendary Riders Wave. Very interesting figure to have in Leg Legendary Riders for Ultron. Yeah, this kind of little glider here, like it's like he's a goblin or something. But yep, yeah, there's that Ultron. Kind of a crazy design. No build of figures at the time. It was just a bunch of figures with their vehicles or tiny little vehicles. So if you notice the design here on the left of that head was the original concept of it. Uh, we did not end up getting that of course. Uh, that was pretty cool looking. There he is on the glider though and there's the back side of the real figure. And there's the glider from all angles. Next time we see him was in the Iron Man wave, Marvel Legends Hasbro. And this one you would build the blue iron monger figure. Front and back of that package, the figure itself. It came with a head for the build a figure. Next time you see it is in a box set. Five figures from Disney Store. And you had Hulk. Iron Man, Thor, Captain America, but you also had Ultron right there in the middle. Marvel Legends Infinite Series. There's that figure and package. Next time on Marvel Unlimited, you see a gold version of Ultron. Of course, this is a exclusive that you have to uh, like sign up for the online subscription for Marvel Unlimited, and you get a figure each year. Next time we see it is in the Ultron Marvel Legends wave where it was a build a figure. So there you see that build a figure with the figures that it takes to build it. You see another Ultron in a three pack, Target exclusive. Mr. Green and a white version or translucent version of Vision here. There you can see that box set right there. Kind of got the effect in the mouth as if it's uh, you know, about to fire off something, but this is like the reuse of the mold for the uh, Ultimate Beetle figure. Just put a new head sculpt on it and give it some new paint job. Re-releasing that build a figure here in the first 10 years with a new paint job from Avengers Age of Ultron movie, MCU. Back of that package. So we see Ultron is not necessarily an Ultron figure, but inside of the vision we actually had an Ultron head. Next time I had a little tease here of a holiday special. Santa coming to town. It's not Santa though, it is Ultron. But there is the Ultron figure that we got. Got the effect piece coming out of the mouth, very cool. This is part of the Ursa Major build a figure wave. Front and back of that package, and I love that effect piece. There's the right arm for Ursa Major, extra hands for the Ultron himself. And there's that full wave. This was an Iron Man wave. Next time we see a, another build a figure is the Infinity Ultron from What If, the Disney Plus show. And of course, this is Vision inside of Ultron. Put the Infinity Stones in the chest. The nice big lamps that comes with this, the cape. And there's the 
there's a full wave, Disney Plus wave to build him. Sides of the package. Size comparison between everybody else in the wave. Or at least She-Hulk, I should say. Next time we see Ultron is in the Cassie Lang, Ant-Man, and Wasp Quantumanium wave. Again, comes with that effect piece there. This time you got the inside of the mouth with the effect as well. Left arm of the Cassie Lang, extra hands. Plastic free packaging. All the other figures in that wave. Very cool figure. There's all of the Ultrons Marvel Legends have done so far. There they all are in package. And then as a wish list or most wanted list for Ultron, I'd love to see Victor Mancha from the Runaways. Because he is Ultron's son. And then I'd love to see Hank Pym as Ultron, like a transformation kind of hybrid cyborgy look. It'd be very cool. Alright, so here is a bonus for this video. Not just Marvel Legends, let's jump into those lines. So Marvel Select, 7 inch scale, Ultron, came out in 2012. Come with that base that you can see there. The background with Ant-Man and Wasp dead beneath them. There's the back of that package. And then your size comparison from the 7 inch to the 6 inch Marvel Legend versus the Marvel Select. Way back in 97, we had the 5 inch United They Stand Ultron. You can see the front and back of that package. It's got that big old giant rocket arm you can put on there or um, cannon on there. There's a cannon, you can just stick it to the side of his arm there, front and back of that figure. Also, 5 inch figure was 1999, the Vault Collection. Front and back of that package. Stegron and Typhoid Mary, those were pretty cool figures for that time. But there's the Ultron figure in the middle. He's got his rockets there, and he's also got robot restraints there, you can see. Three and three quarter inch, 2010. You had a two pack here with Reed Richards and Ultron. Twenty eleven, you had another three and three quarter inch, wave fifteen Ultron figure here. And then you had another three and three quarter inch gold version of Ultron here. This was the when they switched over from Marvel Universe to Marvel Legends series. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave me in the comments, hit that notification bell so you're aware of any new videos that I have. Subscribe to the channel if you ever hit that thumbs up. And I'll talk to you guys later. And guys, don't forget to check me out on Instagram, Pinterest, and especially over on ZachJackDan.com for all the photos you want of these videos.